Hello all, it's Jackie with Vintix98. Um, I hope you're all having a good day. It's been nice and sunny out today. i um, just going to bring you some of the stuff I picked up and some of the stuff I pulled out of that um, large bin of jewelry I bought. So um, we're going to start right here. This is a three strand Aurora Borealis necklace. back and on the clasp this long pearl some texture beads there a couple of aurora borealis and tassel I have this chain. I have it doubled right now because it's a very long chain. Let's see. There we go. Right here. This has a hang tag that says, um, Monet. It's very heavy. And this double strand glass beaded, very small beads on it. The front and the back are the same. colored beads in there and I picked up this multi-strand necklace there's the clasp on it the markings very cute and then just this that's oh, almost a bib necklace, more modern. And this one here is also a modern, oops, case. Have a couple of uh, brooches here that I picked up. Pair of earrings with screw back, blue stone in them, clear rhinestones. There's no marking on these, but I thought they were cute. Got a bar pin here. It's, um, oh, there's the birds. Some faux pearls in it. I picked up this little butterfly. It's for my granddaughter. I thought it was cute. I think she'll like it. Little pearl in the center. Some Aurora Borealis. Some red cabochons. A little spot there, but that's okay. I'll clean it. <clears throat> and this here heart, I believe it's considered an eternity heart with the way they just keep going. Got a citrine colored, it looks like champagne colored, and then the yellow stones. Simple 
pen. Some citrine colored stones and the dark ones. I'm not sure. Picked up this here uh, Christmas pin. I thought it was really neat, different with the bells on it. No marking anywhere. Enameled on the front. And this Omega choker necklace. Turn it over, try and get you to see the back. Oh, there we go. Nope. It has close back. Stones around it and this large red one in the center. It was unique. I um, picked this bangle up at the flea market. I bought it with a couple of other pieces, and they gave this one to me for free. Said I could have it since I bought the other stuff, and uh, got home and tested it, and it is bake light. Just a couple pairs of earrings here it's a loose side I believe this one they all came together so I ended up with these because I wanted those Let's see what this says Marvella. I didn't realize that. I need to claim them. And these are just simple plastic beads or button earrings, I guess. And I picked up this little brooch here, this cherry brooch. Of course, a little thermoset bracelet in orange. Picked up this cute little snowman. It's simple. I have several of these. Hallmark cards. Here, the rhinestones. Let's see what that says. I can't tell. Can't make it out. So, I don't know. Um, this bracelet here, it's Cora. Cora. And I picked this up at a yard sale. It was a good find for a dollar. Blue Aurora Borealis in it. And this brooch right here. <clears throat> the red and I'm not sure what color that would be. Solid on the back. Let's see. You can't see it, but it's solid, and then it goes clear at the top. And this one 
this, the clear at the bottom. That one there, that one, but that one's at the top, so I'm not sure. But there's a good deal. A little poodle pen that I picked up for my granddaughter. I think she'll like it. Simple. And this, I thought it was just, you know, a regular brooch. I saw that it was broke, so I mean, still, it's a good piece. <clears throat> and it is actually a uh, locket, but I am not able to get that open. I don't know if it's supposed to open or if it's just for looks or what, but um, it was only 50 cents, so I picked it up. I didn't want to force it to open. I didn't want to risk breaking any of the pieces off. And the rest over here is what I got out of the, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, the bin that I uh, bought with all the jewelry in it from a yard sale. This piece here, this is the marking on it. I don't know who it is by, but it has an A on the hang tag with the stones. There's the back. And I picked up this chain, it was in the stuff that I picked up. I like the tassel on it. It goes up. Some lone beads. And this I don't think is anything. I don't know if it's a modern piece or not. I think so. Um, has a little rhinestone on the back of the hang tag. And I think it says Chico. It's just, if I can get it to turn around, we'll see. Yes. Yes, I think that's more of a modern piece. But I like it. The base part is a very solid piece, though, and kind of has some weight to it. And a spoon ring. Just a silver plated. Now, all the stuff, again, all the stuff I'm showing you is what I um, got out of that bin of jewelry that I bought. This little... Amethyst colored ring with rhinestones around it. There's no marking or anything. So. This ring as well. This necklace or choker was in it. And I actually cleaned this piece. It was um, all scratched up. And it was supposed to be gold tone. Well, it was gold tone. You can tell by the back. But, um, so, just to try it, I used semi-chrome on it. And cleaned it. I'm trying to get it where you can see it without the glare. It actually turned out very good. But the front of it was not nice and clean and neat like the back. It was all scratched up and chipped. It was in the bin. Um, so now it's a two-tone. I'll call it a two-tone. Silver tone on the front, gold tone on the back. <laughs> and this one was in there as well. This one, where is it? I think it has a 
a PD. I don't know what that means, but this is a cable choker necklace with the X's and a gold tone on it. I believe it is stainless steel. I'm haven't checked it. But I have this necklace. A lot of what was in there, what I pulled out is necklaces. Just go through them real quick here on this gold tone one. Nothing on the clasp. Just this green oval plastic. Here. I still have quite a few pieces that um, I need to do. I'll move over here closer to these. This is a large statement piece. And it is wood. Um, this one. It's cute, but the coating that's on the beads here is coming off, so I don't know what I'll do about that. I will just say Japan. This large, chunky necklace and earrings. More of a heavy necklace. And this um, shell necklace here. Ooh. This silver tone necklace. I like the tassels. And the centerpiece here is rhinestone. And then last one here, and then I'll show you what I have on the other side of the table. These are plastic beads. Rope style chain. And that necklace is very heavy. So that's basically my haul over there for this week. And then this is the stuff I took out of the bin. And here is what I still have to go through. Yep, those two containers were in it. This, all of these, and I still have this bag that I just put everything in from the container. So I still have quite a bit of jewelry to go through. So I hope y'all enjoyed. Please subscribe, like, and share. I would appreciate it.